Tuzungumzie hili ambapo shirika linalojihusisha na ukaguzi wa afya ya mimea nchini Kefis limeanzisha msako dhidi ya wafanyabiashara wanaouzia wakulima mbegu hushi wakati huu msimu wa upanzi unapokaribia. Hatua hiyo imetajwa kama inayotishia uchumi wa taifa pamoja na kusambaratisha utoshilizaji wa chakula huko nchini. Mwenyekiti wa shirika la Kefis Joseph Meruaki amesema wanashirikiana na asasi mbali mbali za serikali ili kuwa na sawa wote wanaoendeleza uhalifu huo kote nchini. Recently we are we are together with the team security team in Akuru. We have to arrest uh, one of the um, suspect great suspects who and uh, who comes from Nakuru, the area of Onjoro. And this person and about 60,000 Kenya empty seed uh, packets for the miss and also some empty bills for the scenes, some machines, even if it uh, cafes um, stickers for the scenes yeah, and also some means that are that were that were the scenes which are fake which were the over 12 million around 13 million kenya ceilings and this were to find their way to the i mean to the market so we are working now we are working with the other agencies to ensure that these kind of incidents do not occur. so this guy is already arrested and is in in police custody so far we have a number of people who have been fined others are in prison uh, because of this, and uh, the fine this uh, can attract up to a million or even two years imprisonment. Na gavana wa Tharakanithi Mudho Minjuki ametoa changamoto kwa kampuni za humu nchini zinazotengeneza vinywaji vya pombe kununua mtama kutoka kwa wakulima wa humu nchini badala ya kununua bidhaa hiyo kutoka mataifa mengine kama inavyofanyika sasa hivi. Akizungumza